ChatGPT, build me a crypto trading strategy which will make me millions whilst I sleep. Guys, I have a confession. I haven't been trading all along. ChatGPT has been doing it for me. I'm going to show you how to use ChatGPT to build, deploy, and trade a crypto trading strategy for you. And the best part, you don't need any experience of coding, of trading, or even of crypto. Yes, this is insane. And I'm going to build three varying strategies with you guys, building up in difficulty in the last one. You're absolutely not going to want to miss. It looks like my years of experience trading is no longer needed because ChatGPT is going to do it all for us. Let's get straight into it. Okay, so first up, the first thing you're going to want to do is head over to ChatGPT. Of course, I have some chat.openai.com. And the first strategy you want to understand is when you're prompting ChatGPT, you want it to role play the position of an experienced crypto trader. So let's say it's mindset right that it knows that it's a profitable trader. So we do that. We say you are an experienced crypto trader who is consistently profitable. Craft me a strategy which I can paste into trading view strategy tester that is based on using the moving average crossover. So for you guys who have worked for my TA course, the Jazz UK forward slash TA, you would know that one of the most basic trading strategies, which is still very, very profitable, is to wait for moving averages to cross over. That gives you an indicator to buy, and you simply buy, and you hold, right? Now we're going to take a look at if ChatGPT can build this for us. And as you can see, guys, straight away, ChatGPT generates the code for us, the PineScript code. I'm going to show you what to do with this shortly. Again, do not be scared. You don't need to know how to code or anything. And it explains what this strategy is doing. Look at this, guys. It's awesome. This strategy uses two moving averages, a fast moving average with length of 10 periods and a slow moving average with length of 20 periods. Now, by the way, guys, if you're an experienced trader, you're going to start to know that, hang on, 10 and 20 is not the ones I want to use. I personally use 20 and 50 when I'm trading. But I'll show you how you can change that because you can just change the numbers in the code. It's very, very easy. See here, input 10 and input 20. You just change it to whichever moving averages you like. Now we can take this code. So click on copy code. And now you're going to want to jump into trading view. And at the bottom here, notice where it says Pine Editor. In this Pine Editor, just paste the code. And we're going to go ahead and press Add to Chart. And as you click that, you're going to see it goes ahead and adds it to chart. And this is awesome, guys. Look at this. Now, what you want to see is straight away on the chart, you can see that ChatGPT has overlaid the two moving averages. And you can see that it tells you when to buy and when to sell. Now, have a play around with the different time frames. Do you want to do this on the hourly chart? Do you want to do this on the four hourly chart? Do you want to do this on the daily chart based on how you like to trade? Now, here's the beautiful thing. With any trading strategy, you want to test that strategy. You want to back test that strategy. Well, now we don't need to do that. With, with TradingView, you can pop into here, click on Strategy Tester, and go ahead and look at this button here. Press Settings, click into Properties. Now, in Properties, we're going to set that we've got initial capital of, let's say, 10 grand. Okay? Now, that doesn't mean you're trading with 10 grand. It means you've got 10 grand in your account. Now we're going to say we're going to trade with, let's say, let's say we trade with $100 per trade. We're going to go ahead and we're going to pop that in. And straight away at the bottom now, you can straight away see it's back testing this strategy for us. It's telling us how profitable otherwise we would have been. So here on the daily time frame, using this strategy with the numbers I just shared with you, it's going to take 76 trades. In other words, the moving averages in that time period crossed over 76 times and it took that trade it generated a profit of $751, which is impressive. It's 7.5% while you're sleeping, okay? Profit factor, 3.4%. Percent profitable, 40%. Okay, so it was only profitable 40% of the time. The other 60% of the time, it actually lost you money. But through the risk management, it's managed to make you profitable overall. And the average trade made you $9. So there you have it, guys. You've just in minutes built your first ever trading strategy using AI. Absolutely insane. But you're gonna wanna wait for the next one because it gets more and more advanced. Now, before I get into the second one, here's a cheeky little trick I use to prompt ChatGPT to tell me what the best strategies are anyway. We'll jump into ChatGPT. What are the top five crypto trading strategies we can build? And again, remember, I've told ChatGPT that it's an experienced crypto trader. So it's gonna be thinking from that perspective. Now, when we look here, ChatGPT has given us out five good strategies. We could do a trend following strategy, 
okay, which tries to identify and ride trends in the crypto market, we can do a breakout strategy. This strategy focuses on identifying key levels of support and resistance. I asked ChatGPT to go ahead and build strategy two for me, build out a breakout strategy. And what it decided to do was it decided to use the Bollinger Bands. And again, if you're familiar with this channel, you guys will know I'm a big fan of Bollinger Bands. When it suggested this one, I was like, we've got to include this one in the video. So what it's done, it's giving us a Bollinger Band strategy and it explains how it works as well. So it builds the Bollinger Bands, okay, it calculates them and then it identifies the breakout. In other words, what it's doing is it's checking to see if the close price is above the upper Bollinger Band and if it is, it asks it to enter the trade, okay? So this is what we're going to do. We're going to take this copy, we're going to copy the code, we're going to jump straight back into the Pine Editor on Trading View, and we're going to go ahead and we're going to paste that in there. Go ahead, click on Add to Chart, and now there you have it, guys. We've got our breakout strategy set up in a matter of minutes. Guys, this would take months and months for an experienced trader to understand first, to build the knowledge, to understand what this is, but then two, to know how to do Pine Script, to put it in the editor, to build it out. You've done it in seconds, guys. You've done it in absolute seconds. You can copy and paste exact prompts I'm giving you, and you can paste it into TradingView right now, and you've got yourself a breakout strategy. So again, let's take a look at the performance of this strategy. You can see again, it's delivered us $772 in profit, that's 7.72%. I look at the percent profitable guys. This is impressive. It's almost 60% of the time profitable. Very good risk to reward. Good profit factor at 6%. The max drawdown is telling you that the max down your portfolio was, remember we started off with a 10 grand portfolio in this example here, was $89. Not too shabby, right? So it's not taking crazy risks here. And the average trade was making you $40 while you're sleeping. And it took a combined 19 trades. Again, all whilst you're sleeping, you didn't have to do a thing, it goes ahead and trades it for you. Now again, remember, TradingView can integrate with your exchange. Now that's set for another video if you want me to go through how to do that, but you can API this into your exchanges, such as Bybit, it does the UK forward slash Bybit, and you can get yourself set up. So it triggers these trades automatically for you. Even better guys, click on alert here, create yourself an alert, right? Click on the condition, I wanna use the breakout strategy which we just set up, and I wanna create this name and say, alert, all right, or time to trade guys. And what it's gonna do is send you a message which you can customize the message when you're ready, when this happens. So when there's a buy signal, when the when the algorithm is telling you to buy, it's gonna trigger a notification either in the app, if you've got the TradingView app, on your desktop, it can send you an email, you can trigger, trigger a webhook, which is a bit advanced if you wanna integrate it into another platform. You can have a sound which plays on your desktop and even trigger an email to go out to you as well. So this is wicked all set up through the notifications here. And again, a nice simple bot for you to get started. But now for the one you're waiting for, we're gonna notch this up a little bit because this is just the start of what ChatGPT can actually do. Let's get into this one. Well, if you wanted to level this up a bit, if you're a little bit more advanced, you're gonna wanna combine two different indicators to give you that perfect signal when to buy. This is gonna give you less trades to take because obviously you're waiting for two indicators to tell you the same story, but it increases the chance that you could be profitable with that trade. This is called Confluence. So we're gonna go ahead and build that in ChatGPT right now. So I asked ChatGPT, can you create a strategy which combines a MACD crossover, right? Which is one of the strategies you could use, again, a very basic strategy, with a breakout strategy. So it's gonna use the breakout strategy and add on top of it that the MACD needs to cross as well. And again, it spits out the code for us, as you can see, guys. It explains how it works as well. So it's exactly the same as we had in two, the same Bollinger Band strategy, but it's added this MACD line with it as well. So without further ado, let's copy the code. Let's jump straight back into our trading view pine editor. And there you have it, guys. We've now got our Confluent strategy. So we've got a combination of MACD crossover and a breakout strategy. And again, you can see the arrows where it's telling us to jump into the position or jump out of the position. Now again, let's back test this strategy, right? Let's go into settings. We're gonna click properties again, take off this silly 100K and say we've got 10K. Let's put this as $100 risk per trade and let's go ahead and see our results. And again, it's made 449 US dollars. It's 44% return here. It traded 25 times on the four hourly chart. 32% profitable win rate, not the best, and it's got a profit factor. We can make this better, right? Let's improve this. So what we're gonna do is jump back straight back into ChatGPT. And this is really when it starts to come in on its own. Now, we know guys, when you're taking that breakout trade, what's one of the things we always look out for? We look out for volume, right? Volume is that nice little indicator that tells you we are safe. The volume's coming through 
the chance of that breakout being successful increases. So I went to ChatGPT and said, ChatGPT, can you also add to the strategy that the volume must be higher than the previous candle to take the trade? And again, we can get even more particular with this, right? We can say the volume has to be twice as big as the previous candle. The volume has to be 20% uh, bigger than the previous 30 days. We just want to see that volume is spiking, which is giving us evidence that that breakout is real. Hopefully you get the point here. It spits out the strategy here. We can copy the code as always. And there you have it. Now we've got our adjusted model here and we can see how this back tests as well today. If you want another video which goes into more detail of how we can tweak these, how we can back test these, how we can make these automatically go into our exchange and trade these positions for us, get this video to 1000 likes and I'll get that video spun up for you. Thanks for watching guys. And I'll see you in the next one.